guys, thanks for watching. Today I'm going to show you how to do this sort of chic updo for dirty hair. My hair is extremely long. If your hair is not as long as mine, that's okay. Anything longer than shoulder length should work with this hairstyle. You're going to begin by pulling the hair towards the nape of your neck in a ponytail and then twist it. You're going to pull the twist, the twist upwards to the top of your head. Um, and then you're gonna begin pulling the hair up over the twist. So starting from the roots of your hair, you're just going to kind of sweep all of the hair forward towards the top or front of your head while still holding that twist in place with one hand. You can also use a comb to help get out some of the bumps. Then you're going to end up with this sort of unicorn horn sticking out of the front of your head. You're going to take the unicorn horn and pull it backwards alongside the fringe twist so it's going to be parallel to the twist and then tuck it under. So you can just kind of imagine that the fringe twist is just eating the remainder of the hair all the way down towards the bottom of your head. And then you can use a bobby pin to hold it in place at this point if you want to. It might make it a little bit easier. Uh, you may have this sort of ponytail hanging out at the end. If you want sort of a funky look, you can actually leave this out. Uh, but what I'm going to do is just pull it back up under. So we're going to pull it towards the top of the head, tuck it under again. So just imagine the French twist just eating it and then take the remainder of the hair, tuck it back under. Depending on the length of your hair, you may need to do this several times. Then you're gonna get a bobby pin. Uh, you're going to insert it at the nape of the neck, downwards towards the nape of the neck, and then slide it upwards towards the top of the head. This will secure the bobby pin, keep it in place. I'm using jumbo bobby pins. Um, you may need to use several of these to keep the hairstyle. If your hair is as long as mine, you may end up with this bun at the top of your head. You're just gonna wanna flatten that down as much as possible using bobby pins without overlapping the front section of your hair. We wanna keep that loose. Once that bun is as flat as possible, your hairstyle is all done. Hooray, doesn't it look fabulous? Just kidding. Uh, we're gonna take sections from the sort of floppy side of your head and pull them over the French twist, one section at a time, pinning in place. Then you'll take the very front section and shape it into a swirl. This should happen pretty naturally because of the way the hair is already rolled. Once you get your swirl in place, you can use small bobby pins to fasten it. At this point you'll look a little bit like a Teletubby, um, but that's okay. Just continue working with it until you get a design and shape that you like. If your hair is thin like mine, you may notice some gaps on the side where your scalp is showing. Just try to cover those as much as possible. So it may take quite a bit of time to fasten everything and get it just how you want it. Feel free to keep playing with it until you get the exact design that you like. You will end up with this sort of big pompadour at the front. If you like the pompadour, feel free to leave it like this and you're all done. What I'm actually going to do is take it down a little bit and pull that little swirl in the front towards the hairline, maybe even slightly overlapping the hairline if possible. So just repositioning it to a more desired shape and then pinning it in place. Then you're gonna to wanna to spray the hair really well. This doesn't mean you're done. You'll notice I still have cracks on the side of my head. You can feel free to fix those and adjust them. Now the hairstyle is all done. Hope that you guys enjoyed this look. Uh, this is my first hairstyle tutorial, but I would like to do more. So feel free to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment letting me know what you would like to see. Thank you so much.